Let's talk about the dry dock incident. Monarch operatives transported you from the university to the ground zero operation at the shipyard. Still upset about that, huh? You were secured, unconscious. Well... Uh... <sighs> Liam Burke went to retrieve you, and you were gone. How? I'm sleepwalking. Step away! Right now! You have three seconds till I pull. I have better reflexes. And you're a marksman. <laughs> We know Beth Wilder assisted you in some manner. Then I'm guessing you know the rest. No, because everybody who saw what you did next is now dead. I didn't have a clue where I was or why. Never questioned it because it didn't feel real. I'm still waiting to wake up. Beth Wilder risked blowing her cover to rescue you. Sounds like you didn't exactly return the favor. No. I didn't. Only way forward. Huh. Well, that's weird. Okay, doesn't last. Noted. When the fracture broke time, some objects became... unstable. With my new abilities, I can manipulate their timelines, rewind them.
There's gotta be another way in there. Not getting through that. There's gotta be another way. I might have to climb in through the roof. Jack Joyce's position. Very well. Ready a chopper for me at the dry dock. I'm heading to the island. Roger. We'll have the chopper. Seeing Paul's face on that screen, it was some kind of sick reminder. I couldn't escape what had happened, what he did. I needed to know why, but part of me wanted to put a fucking bullet in his head before he could open his mouth. That chart was the first sign. Monarch had built an entire PR campaign to protect their reputation. Ferrero's confession goes live in a matter of minutes. What about Jack Joyce? Once that confession hits the air, the whole city will be looking for him. He'll have nowhere to turn. He'll come to me tonight. At the gala? You're sure? Positive. Hey, what's Reaper Squad doing with those video cameras up in A3? Looks like some bitch named Amy's gonna be the poster girl for Serene's PR campaign. Filming confession videos. We blew the library to create misdirection. The media's gonna latch to that, and Amy's gonna tell them the protesters were behind the whole thing. You honestly think that's gonna be enough? We got a hell of a- We got contact! It's him! It's him! Joyce is here! There we go. What the hell is that? Hello? Jack, this is Beth Wilder. Beth? I'm... You're the one my brother was looking for. 
I'm the one who was attempting to rescue your ass until you decided to go on a gun-blazing ship parade through that warehouse. Now listen closely. You're at the outskirts of a Monarch Cronin harvesting operation, and Paul Serene is at the dry docks nearby. Not a recipe for fun times. So how about... Dry docks. If Paul's at the dry docks, then that's where I'm... No! At. Jack, the fracture is our only priority now. Time is ending. Will said he... Will's dead. My best friend came back a goddamn monster. He knew this would happen. He prepared for it. But Paul's the key to understanding all this, and I'm gonna find... We both know that if you find Serene, you're not gonna be asking questions. Think this through. Huh? Paul was at the dry docks in the distance. I recognized a place. William had a workshop in that industrial area for years. I knew that couldn't be a coincidence. just went out, but Hatch wants a follow-up confession. You got the script? Yeah, this one's more reflective. Like, wish we could undo what we done sort of deal. Dave will feed you the lines. Dave? We're using your names. You're not letting me go, are you? You're never letting me go. What was that? You, from the protest, what do you... I am so sorry. I didn't want to, but they made me do it. They made you do what? What is this place? They forced me to make false confessions for the news, I think. I'm so sorry, Jack. They were armed. Hey, whatever you did, it's not your fault. None of this is your fault. I'm just glad you're okay. I knew Marek was doing something, but this is completely fucked up. <sighs> Listen, I need to get to the dry docks. Do you know the way? Uh, no, uh, no, I don't think so. But they took me in through a security station nearby. I can help you find a way through there. I owe you. The security station is right over there. <sighs> oh, I knew Marnock had a dark side, but this? They're controlling the entire media, everything. 
They can't cover this up. It's too big. <laughs> they can. Trust me. It's locked. Ah, okay, there must be a gate around somewhere. Yeah, I'll check. Monarch's twisting the story. Hey, it worked. That can be fixed. I think you need to get to this side of the gate somehow. Jack, you need to get to this side somehow. anywhere until you're on this side of the gate.
My god. You just... You're just like them. Like who? I saw them on the way in. These geared up soldiers that blink in and out. Okay. Well, that's something to look forward to. You know, I thought I was losing my mind when I saw that. You're part of this. I need to know what's going on. You really want to open that can of worms? You just defied physics. I'm entitled to all the worms. All right, my brother tried to explain. Time is an egg, which is now fucked. A time egg, which is, it's fucked. It's like broken, I, I don't know. Time is ending, Monarch has something to do with it. Get me to the dry docks and I'll find out why. Yeah, that should work. Wait here. who was heading some top secret physics project at my university. So it's gotta be the same guy, right? Wrong. Now, I heard that Monarch was there to steal the project from the university, but why steal something from yourself? Also, I saw that guy Paul Serene on campus once and he looked like 30 years old. So if he started Monarch in 1999, that would make him 14. So unless he's a Doogie Howser for corporate America, that's impossible. Banana fucking pancakes. So Paul founded Monarch. Need to get up to that open window. Yeah, that window's pretty high up, but I think it's the only way in. How about that window? Do you think you can get in through there?
Is that another one of those rewind things? I'm starting to get the hang of this. Made it. Now to get to that door. So sorry, Jack. They forced me to do it. I, I know. Of Jack Joyce. There's nothing you could have done. Terrifying scene down there. We really that map over there should help you figure out a lot. Jack, we should take a look at the map. Ground Zero. That's the same area my brother used to have his workshop. I may have to pass through there to get to Paul. Paul? As in Paul Serene? That's why you're going to the dry docks. We have unfinished business. You may want to stay here until I'm done. Yeah. I think you're right. I'll open the door for you. Okay. Stay in contact. Find a radio. I'll be on channel three. And be careful. Yeah, you too. Still no word on Joyce's location. Yeah, heard his brother scream like a bitch when he died. When he shows his face, I'll make him do the same. Son of a... Hostile! We're under attack! Did I scream enough for you? My powers were unpredictable. They kept growing by leaps and bounds. Oh, got nowhere to go! Uh, Target sighted! Man down! Catch him! Jack? 
found a radio. You okay? Still kicking. Monarch radio is lighting up. They heard a noise and know you're coming. Be careful out there. Thanks for the heads up. Oh, great. Shotgunner advancing on hostile. Mother. You want to talk this out? Thanks for the heads up. You still okay out there? Yeah. Any idea where I go next? Level 
before you said hi, Gatehouse Squad was talking about activating security measures to lock some door on the second floor. That's a start. Thanks. Jack, the husky lady on Monarch Radio seems to be unable to reach Gatehouse Squad. Remember the geared up soldiers I mentioned who do the teleporty stuff you do? Yeah. Apparently they're intending to say hi back with a grudge. So there's that. <sighs> Regarding some kind of chronon particle harvesting operation, I'm not sure what that means, but I'm looking into it. Keep you posted. Joyce just took out Gatehouse Squad and you still don't have eyes on him? What, what do they pay you for over there, huh? Charlie, just tell me where he is. Do I hear him, please? Charlie, warehouse B4. Hey, just turned off security. Uh-oh. Jack, they're coming your way. Yeah. I did some digging. This chronon operation is harvesting some kind of fuel. It's used to power a device called the CFR. Ever heard of it? CFR? No, what is it? I'm not sure, but it looks like it's at the center of everything Monarch's doing. The thing they stole from the university, this operation. Everything's linked to the CFR somehow. What the hell is Paul up to? <laughs> <laughs> 